What I've seen with this event so far are tremendous rainfall rates. Those tremendous rainfall rates are a calling card of what we're seeing with climate changing. We see in all regions of the U.S., the top 1% to 2% rain events have increased in intensity over the last 50 years. When you talk to people, they often say, I remember Storm X or Hurricane Y, and that's their benchmark for planning. The problem with that is climate shifts and changes. Those benchmarks are not good context for planning for the current and future storms. This is a very human attribute to say that, oh, I've done this before, I've seen this before, I've lived through this before. But when it comes to what's happening to our weather and climate extremes today, increasingly, we have not seen this before. The terrible flooding disaster in Texas is, so far it's been labeled a one in 500 year event, but we know that climate change is rapidly changing those odds. So things that we can say, oh, well, that only happened when my great, great grandparents were alive. They could be happening multiple times in our own lifetime because climate change is weighting the dice against us. So first of all, we have to adjust our sense of risk and realize that we are actually at higher risk than we were when we were young and that our parents or grandparents were, even if we live in the same place. This is probably trash. The message needs to be, if you're used to some degree of nuisance flooding, you know, every so often, look at what happened in Texas and realize that this is a shifting baseline. Adapting to just the standard, what we have now, it, it may fail you when you need it most.